Hi, Monica. Mr. Uh, Reyes, good evening. Azucena, great to see you. Uh, Mauricio, hello. How you doing? How are you guys? How is your day going? Happy Wednesday. Are you having a good day? Huh? Is, is your day going fine? ¿Qué pasa? Hello, hello. Uh, are you are you good? Are you all right, guys? How are you doing, Mr. Ray? Is everything good? Yes, everything good. I am fine. And okay. you? That sounds really good. I'm doing great as well. Everything is good. I hope. <laughs> today was I Ash, Ash Wednesday. Today, oh, today was Ash Wednesday, yes, yeah. uh, in Catholicism, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So, well, I saw a lot of pictures. I didn't know, but I saw some pictures. Uh huh. So, uh, you didn't did know. You, you didn't no. know. No, I really? didn't know. Um, Why? I don't see the news. You, know? you don't go to the church? Wait a minute. Uh, well, normally I don't see the news. So I was unaware until I went to Facebook. <laughs> and then I realized that, that it was a Ash Wednesday. Mm -hmm. but, okay. uh, but yeah, that sounds just all right. Let me see. Claudia, good evening. Sophie, hello. Asusena, the, the girl with the corals. I love your your like your hair. That's super super cool. Well, guys, uh, thanks a lot for so joining. Sweet. Thanks. Uh, not anytime. So it's really cool to have you guys. Thanks a lot for joining. Uh, one more day. We are um, coming into class number four today. We are trying to um, wrap up this topic of the passive voice that I know is causing you like like a little bit of a headache because like, oh, what am I going to do with this? How am I going to use it? So we're going to try to use it today. Um, to get started, uh, let's say that I have something here like, uh... oh, okay, Monica, no worries. I totally get you. Yeah, actually, I was going to ask you about it because I remember previously uh, you mentioned you were studying, so you were having classes, but I didn't know, right? So that, that is okay, not a problem. So let's take a look at the, like I have here like a couple of questions for you. So maybe you can help me, right? Completing the sentences, completing the statements first, and then we discuss it. So for example, take a look at number one. It says name three books that, uh, can you help me complete a statement using passive voice guys? So name three books that are, that are or that were, And what was that? That's that three books and there are. Okay, that are. are and, we need, and we need the past participle of made. Uh, made. Made, exactly. So it says name three books that are made or that were made into films. Can you tell me three books that became uh, movies? Um. Harry Potter. Oh, yes, I love it. <laughs> okay, so Harry Potter. Yeah. And book, the Lord of the Rings. Ah, what Twilight. Like? Uh -huh. And the Lord of the Rings. The Lord of the Rings. Okay. Any other uh, that you know or that you have read? Agua para chocolate. Agua para chocolate. Is that a book? I think so, yeah. No, that is I, a, a romantic I'm movie, speaking. right? It was a movie, yeah. But, uh, or... No, the three books, uh, the book and the other is uh, Isabel Allende. I don't know. La Isla Bajo el Mar. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm trying to get the English version because like water for chocolate. No, I don't think so. <laughs> no, I don't oh, think so. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. I think so, yeah. Oh, wow. I'm surprised. Like water for chocolate. So it's literally the translation. Okay. So you said Amor. Isabel Allende. Amor en tiempos de cólera también. There is another. Is that for Isabel? Oh, that, that no, is, that that is uh, Gab okay. Gabriel García Márquez, I think so. I think so. And mm -hmm. I heard that the most iconic book for García Márquez, The A Hundred Years of Solitude, is going to become a movie, I think. 
Uh -huh. I, I don't know how because the really? book is so complicated. I, I, yes. I heard last year, I believe, there was a plan to make it a movie. But I'm oh my God. I'm looking for. I read the book like 20 times and I still don't get it. <laughs> it was so uh, twisted. It was so difficult to understand. Yeah. But that was a good one. Okay. So, yeah, very nice. Let's go with number two, guys. Name three things that. Can you help me with a statement here? So name three things uh, that are used by artists. Customs. Very good, exactly. So are used by artists. So can you tell me three things that are used by artists? Customs. Uh, oh, customs, very nice. Okay. Makeup. Microphone. Makeup. Makeup, okay. Microphone, Makeup. yes. Microphone. Anything else? Remember that an artist can be a singer, a dancer, a painter. So there are different type of artists. A sculptor can be an artist. Mm -hmm. Anything yeah. else? Uh, pincel. I don't know how do you say pincel. A brush. A brush. A brush. Uh, yes. Okay. okay. So some brush as well. Okay. Very good. Very, very nice. Okay. Number three. Let's take a look at it. Name three things that were invented. Mm -hmm. Were invented in the last 25 years. Uh, any invention that you can name uh, different from the ones we mentioned yesterday? I don't know. Uh, the last uh, 25 years, mm -hmm. it seems like a, a few time. Of... <laughs> OK, so, so it, it sounds like so short. <laughs> the, okay. computer? the computer? The computer? Probably 25 or telephone more than, more than 25 years ago. Uh, I would say 50. And, and maybe, I, that, maybe, maybe the telephone, oh. like iPhone, electrician car. I'm not sure, but I, I think internet, internet was uh, invented around um, 1990s. I think it was in the 60s ah, the for the water. Yeah, yes. something like that. In the 60s, uh -huh. right? Yes. Uh -huh. but I remember that the, the first computer was invented because uh, because of military purposes in USA. So, uh, yeah. yeah, the thing is that it says 25 years. So I'm trying to count my age <laughs> to the things that didn't exist <laughs> back 25 years. I think somebody had an idea. I don't know. I heard Enrique's voice. Uh, yes, teacher. I think uh, the internet is was invented uh, in the last uh, twenty five years. Oh, well, it looks like more than that. Probably the internet. Uh, maybe we have access to internet. Probably mm. like around five twenty five years. Uh huh. And ago. The electrician car. Electrician. Yeah. Oh, electrical okay. car. Electrical yeah. car. So, Electrical yes. motorcycles. Electrical motors. Ah, oh, yeah, speaking. you're right. Electrical motorcycles, electrical cards. Uh -huh. Contactless uh, payments. Oh, contactless or cashless. Uh -huh. yes. That's right. Especially with COVID, right? Now you do it with the QR or you do it with your cell phone and Bitcoin too. <laughs> so there yeah. are other payment methods. Okay. Okay. Anything else? Drone. Oh, drones. Mm -hmm. drones. Flying drones. drones. Yeah, right. That that is Anything. like a small satellite. Uh huh. There are a lot of inventions. Uh -huh. Anything <laughs> else? Yeah, there are a lot, but maybe we just don't remember. A anything else that you remember? The iPad. iPad. Okay. Yeah. And I would say maybe some applications for watching. Uh, TV without going to the cinema. Uh, so Netflix, we have uh -huh. Android, Android Box TV. Exactly. So, and yeah, now you have some proms, you have Netflix, you have what is the other one? Yes, HBO. Yes, go. <laughs> Amazon, Amazon. Amazon, but there are more Disney, something. Amazon, uh, HBO. HBO, HBO. Uh -huh. so HBO Max. Easy ads go. Prime what is Media. that? Hi, Fernando. What's that? Hi, Chris. Hi. Good evening. <laughs> Sylvia, great to have you. What is that? 
TCS sure. Go is for El Salvador. <laughs> it's TCS. <laughs> Wait, what's that? TCS. Oh, you mean TCS? TCS. Like, to... <laughs> no, <laughs> that's all there. It's a new. <laughs> so even when I was like super young, I remember like I used to watch Chiquilandia and all those things in T TCS. No, channels, in the app, so no. Is the app? Oh, they have an app. Yeah, yeah exactly. Do people watch it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Does it okay. work very well? It doesn't Actually, work. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, because uh, I don't know what what kind of uh, programs people would be watching in in Salvadorian television. So soccer okay. match, for example, soccer match. Yeah. Right. So national soccer matches. Okay. Yeah. Otherwise, I cannot think of it. <laughs> and Domingo para todos was uh, <laughs> I think eliminated from the programming. So I don't know. Okay. I haven't oh. seen TV in a long time. So I am super unaware of what is going on in El Salvador. <laughs> okay. Sure. Yes. Grandiosa. Grandiosa. I Grandiosa. Think. I, do they still exist? <laughs> I don't like I don't like TV, teacher. I prefer I, Netflix. I prefer YouTube. <laughs> I love <laughs> I prefer to see other things also. Oh, yeah. I don't like it. No. Yeah, I prefer YouTube because you can watch random things, videos, like movies, series, a lot of things. So yeah, I'm wanting to a, a YouTube girl, I guess. Okay, let's go into this one. It says number four, name three programs that, can you help me complete it? Zoom? Uh, but the, the, the same. Uh -huh. Name You're three programs computer. that are installed in your computer, exactly. Mm -hmm. Guys, what is a program that is not very common, but you have in your computer? Do you have installed in your computer? In my case, I would say Photoshop. I love photography, so I have Photoshop. And what design. Have? I have in design. Ah, design, okay. Yeah. And Illustrator Ooh. too. Teacher. Oh, Auto Illustrator. AutoCAD too. Auto, what, what is that for? AutoCAD is, uh, is used by engineer. Uh, for blueprints, right? Yes. It is yeah, used for blueprints. For ar architect. Is that yeah, for architect? that's right. Uh -huh. So you can see the design of a building, right? The different yeah. parts. Exactly. Yeah, so blueprints. Android Studio. Android Studio. Yeah. Ah, it's... but you are a programmer, right? <laughs> yes. I we know. Claudia is going to teach us about. <laughs> OK, for, so. Um, antivirus, there is. Blueprints. Antiviruses? Mm -hmm. So you have some antiviruses? Okay. I think I just have an antivirus, but I don't know what it is. Okay. Uh, what else do you have? Any other program that is not very common that you may have? I have, I have Margin Maiden. What it's, is that? Uh, it's using for uh, cells, codes. Uh, what I, is the name of the, of the program? Margin Minder, margin okay. minder. Okay. Minder. Uh, it's a system for cells. Like a database. Uh, no, no. It's like uh, my my salesman uh, do sales uh, today, mm -hmm. and and tomorrow I I'll be uh, I watch that. Uh, they digamos, uh, compraron the buy buy out they, uh, they buy but, okay like like a sort of sales uh, control or sales yes, record con oh yes control sales okay so if you have some vendors they introduce the 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 product the amounts the price and you have the yes. record so it's like a yes, like, I, like a sort of record oh okay yes. very nice sounds good sure. Yes. Peter, I found a, a so far it's very important. For example, if you are using the internet connection of your enterprise, the place on, uh, where you work uh, commonly are restricted. Mm -hmm. But if you install uh, UltraSurf, you can uh, saltar, jump. jump skip. Uh, what? Skip. Skip. Mm -hmm. skip. Skip all restrictions. For example, mm -hmm. uh, you can see 
you too, you can see WhatsApp, you can see. <laughs> I don't know, Rick. <laughs> I, I wouldn't surf? get into that. <laughs> Put a surf and install a, a VPN. Th that sounds like piracy. I ask you. <laughs> Okay. Remember, ultra surf. <laughs> ultra surf. Okay. And tomorrow I'm gonna be checking in the computer. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I think it depends because, uh, for example, one of the one of the the company I normally work for, uh, my computer is encrypted, so I don't even dare. <laughs> Do you know the meaning of the word dare? Do you know the meaning of this verb dare? It is in the chat. Do you know the meaning there? I don't know the meaning. No? Okay. So I don't dare. So I don't dare. There is like atreverse. So I don't dare to check uh, WhatsApp or YouTube in the computer <laughs> um, because I can get into trouble. So. <laughs> sure. Yeah. It's interesting to, to, uh, to see. Uh, how more expensive is the the firewall for the enterprise? Mm -hmm. And a simple program, a simple software can skip the 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 restriction. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the security measures, I guess it has. Okay. Wow. Uh, yeah, but I wouldn't there. <laughs> but thank you for the recommendation though. <laughs> okay, <laughs> guys, any other? Do you have any other program you want to share with us? Nothing no. else. Okay, good. Let's jump to number five. So name three sports that can you complete it? Name three sports that they are played play mm -hmm. in teams. There we go. So yeah, name three sports that are played in teams. What do you have? What do you think? Soccer, football, basketball, 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 basketball tennis. Mm -hmm. um, uh, baseball, right. I don't know how to say it. Oh, cricket. What is yes. it, Cody? Baseball. Yes, baseball. Mm -hmm. Basket. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. There are like a lot of sports okay. there. Hockey. Okay. All right. Yeah, that's right. Uh, would you cannot handball. play it alone? Handball. Handball. Mm -hmm. handball. Exactly. Now there are more sports than in the past. So you have cricket, for example, and there is um, a cricket team in El Salvador. I think it was in Santa Tecla or, or in Antigua, I don't remember. So there are like more sports also people play. Oh, really? Mm, yeah, I didn't know. Also for girls, there was oh. a, like a female a American football league in Santa Tecla. So I was like, wow, that's oh. awesome. Yeah, <laughs> really? I didn't, I yeah. Um, I didn't like, like two years ago, I was yeah. at the Cafe Talon. And I saw like a lot of girls uh, like playing American football. So with the uniforms and all the protection. So I was like, wow, this is super cool. Ooh. Because it is not very common to see new sports, especially in women. So I, I was really impressed, but in a nice way. Um, the last one, guys, number six. Name three, name three things that cannot. Oh, this is interesting. Not... How can we complete it using passive voice? So we need to use where? RB. No. Not our... where? But we cannot no. modify verb B. So name three things that cannot be. B. Mm -hmm. We cannot modify it. And then the past participle of do. So do, do, and do, don't. Don't, exactly. Name three things that cannot be done alone. What are some activities that you can that cannot be done alone? That you need a partner in crime. <laughs> a, that you need like a like a couple. You need a friend to complete them. I think uh, you cannot get married alone. Married. Oh. <laughs> That's a nice That's, example. That is not a couple. That's yeah. very good. That's a That's, very good example. You can not have yeah. a baby. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> well, who knows now with technology? <laughs> yes, and okay. you, you cannot have a conversation with yourself uh, unless you, you are. I, I, do. I, do. I do. Unless you are crazy. <laughs> I, I, I even ask for recommendations to myself. <laughs> the same to, yeah. the same to myself. Saying, yeah. 
As we're not told right about now. victims, not couple. It's victims. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> the Mary is a victim. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, that's not a victim. That's a brave one. <laughs> no, it's not a victim. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not. That's yeah. a brave one. Okay, so you cannot have conversations. Definitely, you need more people. You cannot sure. get married. Yeah. Unless do you remember do you remember the phrase y me dije a mí mismo mí mismo tú crees ah well sometimes you need to you need to place yourself in the mirror right and tell you beautiful things you are cool you are intelligent you can do it so sometimes we tend to have this conversation you're the winner so yeah you'll do it you'll get it so yeah we do anything else that we cannot do alone. Alice, yeah. Do you putting, have any other example? Yes, uh, putting your own uh, hire. <laughs> yeah, well, I agree with you. Well, I don't know because I have seen some men who cut their own hair. They get a haircut, you know, on their own, and they and they do it nicely. Boys, do you do you cut your own hair, or do you go to oh. a barber shop? Only girls. I can. Can you? Oh, yeah. No, Fernando can do it. Uh, yeah, I have seen some men, you know, and they cut their own hair. But girls, what about you? Especially the back. No. <laughs> have you ever? Yeah, have you ever tried to cut your own hair? Or like, no. Or like to get the little bang? No. <laughs> no, I never. So this one is called a bang. So yeah, so we girls, uh, mm. I think it's very common, especially in quarantine. So we tend to color hair, we tend to cut hair, yeah. or try to yeah. do something, right? Yeah. This is a in Spanish. Yeah, that's a bang. Yeah, that's the one. I... And a good teacher. And a... give you a, a hug, uh, un abrazo. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's right. I don't think you can hug yourself. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. So we do have like a couple of examples here. Thank you, guys. Um, let's just jump a little bit with the questions that were kind of uh, pending from yesterday. So um, we didn't have enough time to work on them. But today, I think we can definitely discuss them. So part of the activity for today was to choose one of the questions and to talk a little bit about it, right? To give us a little description, a little um, something. I don't know if you had the time to do it. If not, we are going to improvise. There's no problem. That is the idea, to try to do it and try to speak the most natural way we can. So question number one says, are teenagers given too much freedom these days? Um, I don't know guys, if you have babies, if your kids are, I don't know if they are kids, I don't know if they are teens, or I don't know if you're planning to have babies. Maybe you see your nieces, nephews. Um, so what are your thoughts? Do they need to be controlled? For example, I saw a lot of uh, teenagers uh, buying yesterday um, these Bad Bunny concert tickets. And I was like, wait, how do they get the money? <laughs> yeah. Guacala. <laughs> Okay, that was a nice expression. Now I was like, what? How do they get the money to pay for a concert? And even some guys, I think they are ki kind of young. So they were like waiting there from the day before. So I was like, yes. what about parents? And what about their mom and their dad? And you know, so what do you think about it? Uh, the second says, have you been punished or made to pay for something that you didn't do? like when you were uh, younger or kids or teens and your parents punished you so have you ever been punished and what did you do okay or were you truly innocent um what is the nicest thing that has been done for you remember another person has done this for you and do you think children are spoiled yesterday we checked the meaning of a spoil do you remember yeah, yeah eh, consentido hmm? exactly no, no Yes, mimado, mi consentido, yes, yeah, so okay. if they cry, so parents are like, no, baby, Ooh. don't cry, I'll get it for you. So what do you think? Is this, uh, are they spoiled or not anymore? 
And of course, try to exp express your own ideas. So guys, we are going to join some groups uh, because the idea is to express your ideas, your opinion, and then we are going to try to discuss in general, all right? So I'm going to give you 10 minutes. I guess uh, we are going to work for that. And, and then we come back and we share. So if you didn't take a picture yesterday, you can take a picture of the questions and select only one because of the time. Select only one. Let's go. Go, everybody, go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What do you think about it? Hello. I I saw my nephew today. Uh -huh. um, my sister is so tolerant with him. Uh, but um, she she got uh, the cell phone for para que esté quietecito. I don't know. The nephew. Uh, she, my como le digo, lo lo controla. O sea, this yes. generation, oh. this generation. Uh, find the solution just with cell phone or cell tablet phone. yes or tablet and I don't know in Spanish it's so easy okay this is a technology this is a technology generation 
Yes, and if he if he is um, haciendo berrinchito ahí en, con el teléfono solucionan todo. Yes, but is 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 uh, important for me uh, learn learn uh, uh, when use the the cellular uh, the TV, but uh, I think uh, is is work of the parents learn learning uh, for the for the kids. I think. Well, in my case, I chose uh, the question: Are teenagers given too much freedom these days? Uh, do they need to be controlled? Um, I think that uh, nowadays many teenagers are are doing things uh, which are unsuitable for the for their age. Uh, personally, I think that uh, some kids have too much freedom, and uh, it's a Pity to see a student in midnight in the street smoking uh, when they are supposed to be sleeping at home. Uh, or oh, it's also sad to see youngsters taking drugs uh, when they are supposed to be studying. Uh, I think that uh, these young people uh, have a lot of freedom. Uh, and I think that uh, parents um, allow their child, their child uh, too much freedom and gave them uh, a lot of money. Uh, it's, it's something like that. Um, uh, maybe I think that Mauricio say something about it, that uh, you need to give them some money to uh, people, uh, to young, to younger people, uh, spend in other things that they consider um, important to to the mo only for the moment. I think so. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. So you are right. It's uh, there is a the the the. Uh -huh, the young people right now, especially, especially the people, the young, <clears throat> the youngest uh, that they live with their grandparents, grandparents, and not not with your the parents, uh, directly parents, you know, yes, with the the grandparents because the grandparents can can control it them, yes, can control yes. it. Uh -huh, that is a. There is a it's a it's a very difficult situation for them, and uh, or that is the reason that, that we we saw a lot of uh, uh, youngest or jóvenes. How do you say? Uh, uh, we saw a lot of youngest in the in the in the mall, uh, or or they. They uh, join in the in the maras and a lot of things and, and that's a it's a it's a the, the it's a very difficult situation that yes and, and the parents can with and the well the other thing is the law the law if you uh, hit for example or the you hit are the are my son because. Uh, I don't like that he is doing. He can call to the police and say, "Hey, my parents uh, uh, are hit me." It, it can be the police, and you go to the jail. That is uh, the law right now. It's a, it is a very difficult situation. No, it's okay. a, yes. Uh, but but Mauricio, uh, actually, all of us uh, who have a uh, children have a little guilt. Uh, I think that we give them everything uh, when we're supposed to, to give um, a quality time. 
and no mm -hmm. money, no table, no, no tablet, nor computer, or the the um, moda. I don't know. Do you say el celular de moda? Moda phone. Moda phone. Uh, I don't know. The newest. The newest. The newest you can say or, yeah. or the latest. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. And I think so. And I think uh, uh, all of us uh, have a little guilt. Okay. Mm -hmm. Next. Well, in my case, uh, I choose something that you did not do. Uh, well, uh, I have been guarantor with a person. So I I have to I have to pay that bill because uh, he didn't uh, pay that did that money. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I don't know if you have another another point or about the or the other topic. Uh, for example, are teenagers given too much freedom? Well, it's a must, a little same situation. Uh, have you ever been punished or made to pay for something that you didn't not do? I don't understand that. For me, yes. <laughs> I, I, when, when was a uh, children, uh -huh. um, when a child, when I was a child, um, I, I uh, was uh, punished. Uh -huh. uh, my, my parents uh, thought uh, I broke, I broke uh, a toy of my, my brother, but uh, uh, no, yo no fui. Este, ¿cómo sería? You didn't do. I, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, I didn't. But it's, it's I, I punish it uh, with the uh, in my life. My 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 father. I punish it three times. In 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 all my life, o sea, the, the uh, three times only. But uh, um, si me, me esa, eh, ¿cómo sería? Si me dolió esa vez, but I, I don't, you I hurt. don't, uh -huh. I don't. So you resented. That hurt you. Yes, you, yes. You, you resented that punishment yes. because you were not guilty. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay, so you were punished three times. Uh, in my life, I was punished only two times, but I was guilty. <laughs> okay, so the word is guilty. Mm -hmm. guilty. So like okay. culpable, guilty. exactly. So you're guilty or innocent, right? So innocent or guilty. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Yeah. Okay, very interesting. Yeah. So innocent. you were not guilty <laughs> uh -huh, or you were innocent. What about you guys? Raul, I think Raul's example was related to this, uh, right, Raul? So your, your previous answer, what you were telling us was about this, about something that you were punished for. I think you mentioned a, guarantor. a bill. Guarantor. Um, Fui fiador, fiador. De, uh, oh. de alguien, fiador. Uh, you bother, you bother money. Uh -huh. Oh, wait. You have to pay for, and you have to pay for the bill. Uh, so you have to pay for yes. the other person's loan. Uh, that, all, the wow. all the money. I, <laughs> all the money. I do that too. No. <laughs> yes. Why? Uh, okay. Uh -huh. I'm sorry to hear strong. about it. it was <laughs> it recent or was it a long time ago? Uh, Ten years ago. Ten years I ago. Had to, I okay. had to pay that. Was it a lot of money? Uh, five five uh, thousand, five thousand, five thousand dollars. Yes. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. 
you know uh, uh, yeah wow okay that that definitely hurts you know but i i truly believe that everything you do in this earth um you pay for that later so you will get the karma back. yeah <laughs> karma will come to that person you know and and it comes in in different ways <laughs> yeah yes. so, oh sorry to hear that okay okay girls I, and it, yeah go ahead i think that is very common uh, nowadays when you serve as a warrantor uh, is the correct uh, word warrantor warrantor Yes, uh, you you can um, uh, lose a lot of money for that. Yeah, that's right. So uh, what I tell my friends is, okay, I can be the person who is um, right there at the bank, but I will go to another bank and I will get the same amount of money. <laughs> so it's like, you know, if you leave the country or something happens, so I will get the money too. So, but yeah, that, that is pretty hard. All right, guys, we are going to get back. Give me just a sec. Hold on, hold on. All right, guys, uh, thanks a lot for coming back. I think a couple of the guys are still practicing. Give me one moment. Just hold on a sec. Yes, they are still practicing. Let's, let's just wait for a couple of minutes until they are back. Teacher, I have a question. Si no está la teacher. Yes, I'm here, but I'm in mute. Ah. <laughs> yes, miss, tell me, what's your question? Teacher, I have a question. Uh, I don't know, I don't uh, find mm -hmm. uh, uh, the, the word for los padres son cómodos. O sea, I don't, I don't have the, the the specific word for this or the expression uh, there are a couple of ways to say it but probably mm -hmm. not the word commodo but mm -hmm. we can use for example the word um i don't know if this would, will work but that can be like carefree like parents mm, they are to relax probably yeah. or we can use the word laid back que es la que más se parece. So laid back is exactly like that, you know, like a person who doesn't pay much attention or it's like whatever, you know. So because otherwise, uh, yeah, I, I would just I would just lay back. So parents are just to lay back. Mm -hmm. I would just that one. Teacher, Let me I, if I get another one. Something? I love to spoil. I love. To spoil my daughter. Oh, okay, okay. So you love to spoil your daughter. Yes, I agree with that. With okay. Spoil. okay, but because like. My, my but it depends daughter, on the circumstances. I think it depends on the measure also. Ah, I <laughs> think then, there is a limit, right? There should be yeah, a limit. Yeah. So how much do you so spoil much. your kids? Mm -hmm. I don't have kids, but oh. I guess there must be a limit. <laughs> so how much do you spoil your kids? If I can buy all the she wants, I sold. The woman spoil a lot, a lot. Really? Do you think Not so? All. <laughs> yeah, they are very, uh -huh, they are very, Consciente mucho a los, a los hijos. They spoil, so ah, they spoil the woman, kids ajá. that much. What is the role of the father in this moment? Oh. 
<laughs> what is the role of the father? <laughs> that Mauricio, is a question. Mauricio <laughs> got in a very dangerous topic, yeah. Yes. <laughs> but it's too but dangerous. Where is the father? Oh, where but it's true. Father? It's true. It's true. Are you well, the father in English? <laughs> Mauricio is studying English right now, <laughs> so he's busy. <laughs> no, but but you know that is a very nice topic. I I guess we can talk about it. who do you think spoil children more? In your case, guys, for the ones who have babies, are you the one who has spoiled your kid more, or is it your your spouse? Is it your couple? I think the father is more. Uh, I is, I don't know what is what is the word. Uh, mas consentidor. They spoil. No, they pamper no. kids. Very, okay. Yes, because uh, he does doesn't have time for the children in all day, no. Pamper. And the mother is always accompanied. I don't know. Accompanya. Mm -hmm. uh, Accompany the children all day, includes include uh, when she's mm -hmm. working. <laughs> Mm, that's a good yeah, point. Good point. You yeah, know? that's true. That's true. The okay. woman, the, <laughs> the woman gave more, <laughs> the, the woman gave uh, more quality time at the children's than the men. Uh -huh. More yes. okay. Yeah. More quality or more quantity. Quality it depend of the boy. Quality, or the, or the, I or think the woman. quality time. Quality time. Quality. Uh -huh. quantity, I think. Oh, what about the rest? What do you think? I mean, I see the I case so. of my brother, for example. Um, my brother has a girl. She's eight years old. But uh, it's not her mother, the one who spoils the girl. But it's my brother. And, the, and you know, he's like, oh, yeah, baby. But <laughs> there is a limit because when it is something like too expensive, he's like, mm, no, you need to behave well. You need to get, uh, get good grades, right? And when you do that, I'm going to get it for you. But I think my brother is the one who pampers uh, the girl a lot. But I don't know, guys. What, what do you think? Dago, Dagoberto, tell us. Dagoberto has been very quiet today. What is your experience? And he has a lot of experiences to share. I, I enjoy to spoil my child's uh, five girls. Oh, only girls, um, no boys. No boys. Wow. And and, and now uh, I like to help her help them. Okay. With with the their need. Oh. With their okay. need. Uh, I enjoy it. Uh, I see that I I I was very spoiled. So you were the one who spoiled the girls more than uh, their mother. Uh, maybe, maybe. Oh, okay. So nice. We have a different opinion here. Okay. But, but I, I, I work all the day. And, mm. entonces, ¿cómo digo entonces? Huh? So, I miss so. Then, mm -hmm. then I uh, use my time for that. Oh, that sounds very nice. Okay. Cool. What about the rest of you guys? Who has babies? Oh, what happened? I didn't, I didn't spoil with any any parents. You were not spoiled. Uh, yeah, I, uh, yeah, I wasn't spoiled. Oh, that's another point. <laughs> were that's you spoiled? <laughs> oh, oh, were you spoiled? So when you were uh, like kids or you were not spoiled? Spoiled. Let me just write it down. So you can I say it this way. I was spoiled or I was not spoiled, right? So guys, it's were you spoiled. spoiled? I wasn't. So we I were wasn't. we were six siblings, like three boys and three girls. So I was kind of almost the last one, but I wasn't spoiled at all. And my brothers were not spoiled either. Yeah. So yeah, tell us. I remember I was uh, spoiled by Oh. by my mom because my okay. father died when i was three years old and um, uh, she spoiled me but she punished me too when i oh. when i don't i do bad things the 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 two things 
And oh. I, I have a question for you. Sure. What do you think about uh, moms? I generally say, I love all. Do you think it's true? I love you all. Mean, I, I, I love uh, igual, de igual manera, equal. You mean, you mean like when a mother says that, like they, they don't have a favorite. Los quiero todos por igual, dicen. Mm. Do you think it's true or, or it's not true? I don't know, but I can tell you my in my experience, for example, we were a lot, you know, so and um, I am the fifth out of six, but I can say that my mother truly, um, she didn't take a side, you know, if we did something bad, she was like, okay, come here. <laughs> I'm gonna punish you because you did this and you did that. So it didn't matter if I was the youngest or somebody else was the oldest. Why the broken heart, Sophia? <laughs> so I have to say that, yeah, in my family, my mom didn't have a favorite. What about you guys? Sophia, you were not spoiled? Yeah, I didn't spoil it. That is the reason I my so you were not I spoiled. spoiled. So, but how old are are she, Sophia? Oh, that's another <laughs> point. Uh -huh, how, how because if uh -huh. it's a child or is a I don't know a, a young, teenager, uh -huh, a teenager. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's right. How old is your baby? Ah, uh, nine. Oh, nine years old. So. But, but it's a girl, so she's a still a little girl. All right, that, that's a very nice point, uh -huh, because if they are like teenagers and they ask you, hey, mom, I want to get the, I don't know, Samsung 22 Ultra Plus, etc. So it's, oh, yes, baby, of course, whatever you want. <laughs> I don't think we would do that. <laughs> uh -huh, so that is actually the point. Guys, let's review something here really quick, um, especially when we are talking about these uh, difficult birds, right? Like punish, for example, spoil. So, um, okay. Blame, that is another bird that can be a little complicated. So um, let's take a look first at the meaning. So punish is when you do something bad, right? Spoil is when you are granted everything you want. And blame is when you do something, but you say, oh, I didn't do it. My brother did it. So you blame other people, right? You say that another person was guilty. But now let's take a look at this. If I say, for example, I punish, is because I am the one who gives a punishment to another person. Like I punished, I don't know, my, in my case, for example, my niece, right? So I punished my niece, I did it. But what, how can I say, yo fui castigada? What would be the idea? Because I cannot say I punished. I punish means yo castigue a alguien. I, so was how, I, was I was punished. I was punished, exactly. So I was punished, okay. Now with the spoil, is the same idea. If I tell you I spoil um, my little brother, all right, is because I'm like, oh, yes, brother, whatever you want. So I am the one who grant everything for my brother. But what, how can I say the opposite? Like, yo fui or yo soy um, mi mala consentida in this case. How can I express that idea? I am spoiled. Yes, or I I spoiled. Exactly. I was I, or was? I was. Mm -hmm. So I am I spoiled or I was spoiled. Exactly. Oh, yes. So, but that would be take a look at this. I was. So this is the difference. I punished, yo castigue. I was punished, yo fui castigada. I spoiled, so yo consiento a alguien. I was spoiled, yo fui consentida o soy consentida. If you, remember what we said yesterday? I can use this in present. For example, uh -huh. I am spoiled. Es como ahora todo el mundo me consiente, yeah. right? Que galán. <laughs> so yeah. I am spoiled, all right? That will be present. Blame. This verb is really interesting as well. So um, yeah. if you say, yeah. for example, uh, have you ever listened to the song Blame on Me? So I blame, right? Um, or in past, let's make it best. I blame my sister about the glass getting broken, for example. 
So take a look at this. If I say I blame my, my sister, that means my little. I but what is the meaning? Acusar, means, no. Uh -huh. But <laughs> Culpa. Culpa. That is the word. Exactly. Culpa. Exactly. That would be actually in Spanish is more like echar la culpa. Yeah. So when you say you blame, it's like, oh, se lo hizo, se lo hizo. You blame a person. If I tell you I blame my sister. Shame on you. Shame. What is? What does that mean? Oh, that's a little different. So it's like. Qué vergüenza. Bueno, yeah, bueno. But, but the expression shame mm -hmm. on you um, es más como una expresión, you know, uh, como cuando realmente usted le está achacando algo y le dice shame on you, qué pena das, you know, que no te debería dar pena. So that oh, would be the expression. Hmm? What a shame too, teacher. What Excuse a shame. Me? What a shame? Mm, not necessarily. What a shame is more general, right? If oh. I tell you, for example, oh, I got no money. I got bankrupt. Oh, I'm sorry. What a shame. Qué pena, right? But shame on you is most personal. So if you tell me, for example, I don't know, um, I was playing Free Fire. I invested a lot of money on that and I lost the game. Shame on you. You're shame playing Free you. Fire. Uh -huh. shame, so, on shame on you. a loser. Quizás, no, <laughs> shame on you es como más acusadora, ¿eh? like, te debería dar pena, ¿eh? so you, shame on you, that would be the expression, but blame, ajena. vergüenza ajena, ajá, ajá, that would be shame on you, but the expression blame is a little different, so blame is like, yo le echo la culpa, I blame my sister, now, si alguien me echa la culpa, ¿cómo lo expreso? How can I express that? How can you say, me acusaron? Uh, me echaron la culpa. How would you I say that? Blame. Exactly. So that is the difference between active voice and passive voice. So remember, en uno yo hago, en la otra yo soy la víctima. So if I tell you I was punished, so pobre de mí, right? Poor me. Um, I am spoiled, so también. I am kind of the person que es mi mala. And the last one, I was blamed. So yo fui acusada. So that is the idea for you to have it a little clearer. Uh, a little clearer here. So like, yo fui. That is passive voice. Guys, no sé si we are good. We are fine. Do you have any question here? Um, Chair, I have a question, but sure. only with the first verb. Like when you say, I punish my niece, mm -hmm. uh, you refer that you, you do the action for your niece, yeah. right? That's correct. But, uh -huh. but in the other case, if you want to say, um, I was um, punished, oh. the bear also is in past, right? Oh, yes and no. Let me explain why. Uh, in mm -hmm. English, we have regular and irregular verbs. Um, yes. And this is a regular verb. So for past and past participle, the verb is exactly the same. So we will not see any difference. And it looks like past. Let's say that is past participle, but yes. So I punished my sister. I was punished by my parents, for example, by my parents, because the idea is really different here. Um, you will see this change uh, a little bit bigger when you come to see irregular verbs, verbs that, that change from past to past participle. Let me think of an example. Spoiled. Spoiled is the, <clears throat> is the same when, because uh, it's, it's, the there, thing are, with there the are spoiled and spoiled. A, it can be both. It can be regular and irregular. Okay. Mm, oh, for example, I showed my notebook to my uh, teacher, for example, here. So I showed my notebook to my teacher. So the past is show, but the past participle of this verb is a little different. So I can say the opposite. I can say me mostraron la casa, for mm -hmm. example. So that would be I was. And the past participle mm. of show is mm. shown. Oh. I was shown the notebook. Mm. I was shown mm. the house. Exactly. So you will see these like more, more clear when you see irregular verbs. 
in this case, in the first, is because the verb doesn't change for past and past participle. It is exactly the same. It's a regular verb. Mm -hmm. no, because it okay. is a regular verb. That's correct. Okay. okay. Thank you for All right. No teacher. worries. You're totally mm -hmm. fine. Okay, guys. Look, I'm going to give you a little homework assignment for tomorrow. So, oh my goodness, time goes so fast. Okay. So, the homework assignment, guys, is really easy. Vamos a hacer una trivia. We are going to make a trivia with uh, passive voice. Okay. Les voy a pedir okay. que solamente armemos cinco um, statements, ok, como una especie de trivia. Puede ser de música, puede ser de cosas generales. ¿Cómo le vamos a hacer? Por ejemplo, uh, the song, querida, was, y necesito el pasado participio, nice. so song, by, y lo vamos a dejar hasta ahí. So, es una trivia, entonces ustedes pretty much tienen que adivinar. Vamos solamente a crear la estructura. So, the song querida mm -hmm. was sung by, guys, can you give me the answer? Juan Gabriel. Ah, yes, of course. <laughs> so, exactly. So, vamos a crear una especie de trivia this way. If I tell you, for example, the light bulb, all right, was created, no sé si fue created, was created by, me corrigen si that is wrong. So, the it light bulb was made, was no. Made? Invented. 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 Okay. invented. So, invented. So, it was invented by... Da, 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 da. What is the answer? <laughs> I don't know how it is. Thomas Alba Edison. Edison. Yes, Edison, exactly. Edison. So wow. if you take a look, ahora sí me interesa quién lo hizo. Entonces por eso es que le estoy agregando el by al final. Porque es like who okay. did it. So vamos mm -hmm. a escribir cinco oraciones. Five uh, similar. Pueden buscar the discoveries, music, um, I don't know, movies, right? Or anything. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm, books, exactly. Books. books. Hay muchas categorías y las compartimos mañana. So we will share that tomorrow. Um, okay. All right. Guys, recordemos que para mañana debemos de avanzar con la plataforma, la sección número uno en number two, right? If possible, please. So thanks everybody for your participation. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful Thank night. You. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye